Oh, there's little quails. Oh, there's a boat. It's hard to see them. There's one, two, four of them I can see. Oh, there they are. Nervous little things, aren't they? Some type of quail. We've got ten types in Australia, according to Wikipedia. Focus intelligent camera. I don't know how many families of quails. Oh look, oh, so this is our estate. We've got, where, what have we got? What am I pointing at? Oh, there we are. So we've got quails and bunny together in one scene. There goes Sampa, our pet little rabbit, with his beautiful ears, aren't you gorgeous? Off he goes. Now back to the quail. So this is our estate where we have all sorts of game birds, like quail. Where are you? I can't see you. I'm actually trying to film parrots, actually, if you want to know. Where are they? Where's that brick? Oh, I see. There you are. There are the quail. And if quails eat hemlock, their flesh can be poisoned. We have hemlock in Australia. We have conium maculatum. That's hemlock. You can tell him not because the leaves smell like rats or mice. If you go to a pet shop, that smell of rats in a pet shop, that's the same smell that hemlock leaves smell like. Anyway, quails, some types of quails eat hemlock and that makes the flesh poison to human beings. So these are our game birds. We don't have any pheasant at present. Some years back a neighbour's peacock had come into our place, it was gorgeous, but I didn't have my camera handy. When I came back with my camera it was gone, it was a gorgeous peacock. Hello quail, you look really grouse, don't you? Oh look, here they are, here's my little quail friends up close. Come on sweetie pies, where are you? There they are, the quail. Anthony quail. Now how do you gender the quails? Is that the mother? Aren't they cute? They're just like the penguins on small films. The penguins, they run around in exactly the same manner. They won't stay still for long, do they? That's a little quail. Aren't you cute? They're so nervous. But, as I said, I was trying to film Rosella. It's not rabbits or quail. That's a Rosella. It's not illuminated well enough, is it? It's not. You're not well illuminated. Where's that quail family? 
a whole family of quails. I don't know how many families there are. I don't know how many quail families we have on our estate. But this is our estate. This is my truth. This is my world, folks. To quote Oprah Winfrey, this is my truth. It's a truth for me to be surrounded by quails and rabbits. Come on, sweetie pies, look at you. Aren't they cute? Oh, there's a parrot now. This is my truth, folks. This is my truth. This is our pet parrot. His name is Robin Redbreast. <gasps> Oops, I spooked him. That's Robin Redbreast. The Eastern Rosella. Just hang about, don't bolt. That's an Eastern Rosella. Iconic Australian bird on sayo biscuits and a Rosella tomato sauce. Oops. Jump in, go on, jump. Take the plunge. Take the plunge. Jump in. That's it, jump in. Have a bath. That's it. Have a good wash. I can see quails on in my right hand peripheral vision, but I can't film everything at once. Listen to that water. You're wet now. You're soppy. Soppy. Soppy little rainbow bird. Hello, soppy. Look, he's scratching just like a cat in exactly the same way. Well, the parrot's up in the tree now, so I may as well film the quails again. Now remember, if your quails have been eating hemlock, you can be poisoned because the flesh will be poisoned if you eat quail meat, which I don't. What, which would you choose, a vegetarian sausage from the supermarket or a quail? You wouldn't be eating ruby salt bush, would you? That was a gorgeous little quail. Hello, quail. Aren't you lovely? Aren't you lovely, quail? What a beautiful quail. Oops, the pigeons, their f wings have spooked the quail. Where are they? Oh, they're hiding in the primrose jasmine now. Look who's back a minute later. Look who's back. Where have you got to? I can't keep up with that thumper. I don't think anyone could get keep up with thumper. Not even a greyhound. Look who's back an instant later. Are you the same Rosella? Are you the same Eastern Rosella having a bath? Thumper was here a second ago. Rainbow bird. Rainbow bird. Uh, 
and the quails are in my peripheral vision again. I can't film two sets of birds at once, I need a, one of those double cameras. Woody Wagtail. That's a grey fantail. A grey fantail is having a bath as well. But, oh look, he just threatened. The fantail just threatened the Rosella. Oh, don't go, Rosella. Look, there's Thumper in the distance. Where's Thumper? So, are you a grey fan tail? Or are you a woolly wagtail? I think you're a grey fantail, but I'm not sure. I'm no ornithologist. Are you a grey fantail? They don't hold still for long, do they? They really don't. Australian bird life, folks. I can't keep up with those quails either. They're all over the place. all over the place. I don't know if it's one family or several families, but they're all over the place. All over our grand estate. And hold still. Still, little quail. I just can't keep up with them, can I? They're hard to keep up with all these birds. Quail won't hold still, Rosellas won't hold still, Thumper will hold still. Now what's this little bird getting about? Is it a yellow-tailed thornbill? I don't think it's a silver eye, is it? Is it a yellow-tailed thornbill? Oh, still come out in the open for us, come on. What are you? You're not a silver eye. You're not a silver eye. I think you're a yellow-tailed thornbill. You've got a yellow tail and you've got a bill that's a bit like a thorn. But you won't hold still. Oh. Hold still, you little fool. That's a yellow tail. Perhaps it was a yellow tail thornbill. Oh, look at that. There's a little double barred finch. Oh, it's gone now. Just when I focused on it, it disappeared. 
That's a golf ball. The Karawongs are ravens. I picked them up and dropped them here, I've decided. How else could they get here? We have golf balls all over our place. The golf course is on the other side of the village, but all the uh, birds pick them up and drop them over here for some reason. <laughs>